So we write software that controls uh, energy storage, so batteries, uh, and by controlling it, we're able to deliver services uh, both to homeowners and to the grid. And in doing that, we actually make storage uh, economic today. When the grid was first built, sort of 50 or 60 years ago, it really was a case of consumers bought energy from state-owned utilities. But obviously in recent times, consumers have, you know, are now much more empowered, um, primarily because a lot of them generate their own power from solar panels. And so consumers really want to participate more fully in the operation of the grid. And you know, storage is the next step in that. And storage really enables consumers to have uh, you know, a significant amount of energy freedom because they're no longer tied to only being able to generate when the sun's up. So with storage, you're able to obviously capture energy that you've generated during the day and then use it um, at night. And typically that's when you're paying peak prices. But I think the other interesting thing that Reposit does is we don't just do that. We also allow consumers to actually sell their energy directly into the wholesale market when prices are high. Um, they're able to help support grid frequency to make the grid healthy and stable. Uh, and then they're able to provide um, energy and power to the networks in order to keep the networks stable as well. And that's, uh, that's really the additional value that Reposit creates is that we're taking a single piece of storage and making it really useful for lots of different people. And that leads to you know, consumers actually being paid for all of those services.